but the light's pretty bright, so it's hard to see everyone coming in. So this is going to be winner's quarters. Winner qualifies the top eight, so we're going to have Snake versus Ike. DJ probably would be considered the second best Ike behind Ally. Yeah, no, I'd have to agree with that. He, he, you know what it is also because he doesn't play as often. Like he kind of, kind of like you, you come through for like big events at like all the games. Yeah, but he just stays so consistent. It's crazy. I mean, he plays melee all the time, and yeah. Ike, you know, Ike isn't like the most complex character. Like, not saying he's easy to play, but you know, once you know the options, you know yeah. the options. You know. Well, we so, used to joke around. I don't know if it's still true that the the DJ special was back throw into forward air because it covers so, so much. So, yeah, yeah it covers and then so you, like, if you can just fast fall too, so it covers like everything. Whoa. Yeah, the hitbox is humongous. It's it covers ridiculous. such a great arc. Um, but it's be interesting to see because the biggest difference between two of them obviously is a ton of experience. And like, forward smash. <laughs> um, and then, oh yeah, we're going to see a bunch of sticks and tranks. So and I wonder if this is it or if this is a button warmer. That was it, okay. <laughs> and so I feel like this matchup, I can't tell who wins because um, Snake's obviously going to have the more ex uh, explosive combo game. I really need to stop making that pun. <laughs> but like once I once Snake is off stage, I feel like forward air just covers so much that it's going to be almost impossible for Flip to recover. Yeah, and if you do recover, the amount of damage you're taking between the forward air and your own like sticky to recover from you know underneath the stage and stuff, it's going to be kind of silly. Oh, that was, that was crazy! Like Godlike air dodge by DJ. Wow. Do you think he really intended to pick yeah, up the grenade? Yeah, completely. Yeah, some next level stuff. Are we going to be on stream? Okay. After the after the set. Oh. And Flip taking the first stock from DJ, only at 46 percent. But again, so that's the most terrifying thing about Snake, because he can stick you, but he can stick you with state, uh, not shield too. So it's kind of hard to kind of work out that shield habit. Like I should be safe in this particular moment, and then you, and then you, you don't, sh and then it's like, oh, he's gonna stick me, so I'm not gonna shield. I'm just gonna like hit him, and then he down and You're like, oh, yeah. And there you go. And then something simple as that, just a tech chase on the platform with, with sticky, is also pretty, uh, pretty. Oh, hey, you can tech pistols in this game. I forgot, and that's gonna be. Mm -hmm. Oh no, it's not okay. Oh, that'll take. Yeah, I mean, the snake, the vertical kill potential is absolutely ridiculous, so. Oh, Cypher. I mean, I know I, DJ was complaining about this, uh, Matt, yes, or Flip, or Snake just in general yesterday, yeah. or it was, it was him or Moon, I don't remember which one. Um, because it's like, why can't I do it in shield? That's so dumb. Oh, that was beautiful. Blew up the C4 and then stuck him right after. Yeah, that's probably one of the more common complaints about the snake gameplay is the fact that it can do on shield. How did, um, the, how did the mind blow up? Uh, he, he probably started to place another one. No, he didn't. He like down tilted below it and it blew up. That was really weird. I didn't catch it. I was watching DJ recover. <laughs> and so the oh. cool thing about, you know, uh, snake in general, oh God, so strong. Um, is like typically, you know, you're going to down air and then it pops you up on the fourth hit. But if you fast fall, the down air on the third hit, you just kind of stay there and you can just, you know, get like comboed for a while. And that's going to be a JV four stock hey. flip looking like he wants to go to winter semifinals. I mean, uh, did he you just can't just beat Sam and then just wink at us, dude. Yeah, he, he winked at me, I'm pretty sure, specifically. Okay, I'm, I'm, yeah, you're probably so right. I have the monitor in my way. Dude, that was, uh, that was pretty. Okay, now I'll just. I'll just finish the set. How'd it go? How'd you do? But so. DJ, so as a snake, I feel like I would ban wall stages. I mean, he banned Wario. Where, yeah, he banned the two wall stages. So that that makes sense because it's um, you know, I can't recover super like super ridiculously. Yeah. He did run it back though, but he didn't see much success on the stage. So yeah. I don't know if it was just. I just think he doesn't know the matchup, and he's like, I understand that I don't know the matchup, so let me just go on a stage I'm comfortable on. Yeah. Like I don't think he knows better or worse, you know. I'm wondering if like maybe a stage like Smashville to give him less platform give Snake less platforms or at least a platform that's moving around to free up Ike a little bit to move around. Yeah. yeah rather yeah. than a landmine just sitting there. Like because a, a landmine on the platform poses a lot of movement options. Yeah. God, the X there is so fast it's Ugh. It's like gross. Oh good job shielding the trank right there. Oh we could have you gotta kill them. Kill them anyway. So Ike's up air, second swing hits much harder. Really? Yep. Has more knockback. I, I I just learned that not too long ago. Um, Why? Ho hopefully, uh, hopefully that's correct. But yeah, the second swing around will actually hit harder. So that that's why I mean, that, that works sense. so great. I honestly like when moves that like it, like their longer duration incarnate like is more. Oh no, I don't think he knows about. Does DJ know about the thing that you don't get your legend vulnerability back? I don't. Uh, we're about to find oh, out. No. <laughs> you somehow didn't get hit that whole time though. Uh, it's I think five. Oh no! Oh. Forgot about the mine. Unfortunate. And only 2% separates them, and the mine's going to be on the left. Let's see. Yeah, DJ breaks it. Yeah. 
Although, I, I'm kind of iffy about breaking the mine because, like, as much as Snake can combo you into it, you can combo into yeah. it. So I feel like using your invulnerability to get to Snake and probably try to hit him is more important than just blowing up the mine that's, like, you can both utilize anyway. Oh. Yeah. I agree with you. That's probably one of the more annoying things, too, when you come in back from a stock and you feel like your invincibility frame's been taken from you because you, you have to go deal with a mine. Yeah. Uh, oh, and, God. And we've seen, like, I've seen Sheiks use the mine as a down throw. Uh, oh, did you not? Oh no! Oh, oh that F smash. No, that, sorry, yeah, that F smash was super close. Oh, luckily for him, he was up in the air already. Didn't get caught by the trank. Yeah. And should be. He's going go for a footstool. He's going for a footstool. Oh no, he's just oh, gonna edge guard. All right. Yeah, pretty free. Oh wow, he lived. I he's fat. Oh, another grenade. I think if I don't think he knows where the line is, which is why. Okay. Wait, if, I don't even know where the mine If Flip was up with stock, I think he would have went for the footstool on that ledge. That's kind of his style. <laughs> Probably. But I think right now he realizes oh, there it, that oh, was... He, 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 oh, he, that was so smart. He planted it on the purple of the Master Ball, so it was harder to see it. I I guess, because DJ definitely ran right into it. Because, I mean, I was and I don't think And I don't think, like, I don't think that's like DJ would do that if he knew that was there, you know? Like, he, yeah. he was, like, strolling through the park and just gone. I can't believe that mortar hit. I'm surprised. Grenade's so good because you can approach with shield pretty much for free because they can't even hit you because they're just going to get grenaded. Yeah. The stage control by uh, Flip is so, so good right now. This is where Snake gets really hard. Like, he, trying to kill him at these crazy high percents and he's dead. Oh, Lord, Lord. I'm a liar. I'm DI a dirty the, liar. The eye of the Lord right now. Man, I wish I was fat. Oh, oh but he rounds into the mine. How unfortunate. He doesn't look too upset though. He's kind of just like, yeah, Snake. Yeah. Um... I mean, he's he's probably thinking like I got melee, <laughs> like you know something, yeah. you know. Oh no! It's also one of those like you know if you don't commit to this game that much, like you understand that if you get out like if you get like random matchup, you're like, well, yeah, that's what I get for not playing the game. Yeah. I mean, it, and I'm sure he's frustrated with his voice. Oh, oh that's you realize that's that shield damage, down yep. airs. Oh, misses the stick. Yeah, don't kill from the side. Okay. <laughs> he's gonna hold the grenade. Yep. Protect. Oh, oh no. strong bad this. Or sorry, he, he was gonna die anyway. He could not have died and take the wall. Yeah, that was so also like now like one hit is gonna just pretty much do it. Uh, trank, trank into sticky. We'll pretty much confirm kill right now. Oh, and he's off stage. He's gonna be okay. He's able to recover. Oh, Stuck. and he overcommitted to wow. that, and he got the stick right before he did hey. that. So it combos into the C4, and that is going to be the game two all the flip. He advances into winter semis.